it's your boy the hot rodster here and today we're going to be logging in another entry to the quirk registry by examining the quirk rewind rewind is an emitter type quirk that allows a user to reverse a living thing back to its original state the user of this quirk is a little girl, Eri, who is also the focus of the Shi Hasakai arc. She currently resides at UA and is being taken care of by the hero Eraserhead. The quirk's name, Rewind, is actually really simple. When most people use the word rewind, it's typically in reference to a video, a channel on TV, or some sort of movie, and it means to go back to a specific moment. The dictionary definition is actually to wind a tape or film back to the beginning. The simple name actually describes this quirk really well despite having nothing to do with rewinding videos. Like I said earlier, rewind allows the user to reverse a living being back to its previous physical state. Once the quirk is activated, the horn on Aerie's head starts to grow brightly, and then those who are in close contact to Aerie start to have their bodies rewound to a previous state. It can undo injuries or modifications from the present or past, and because of how time works, it can be used to bring back those injuries and modifications as well. The logic here is that if she rewinds an injured person back to before they were injured, their former injured state is now their past state. Since Aerie can reverse a person to their past state, you can reverse a person back to that past injured state. Hypothetically, this quirk is even capable of reversing All Might back to a time when he had one for all, or even to a point where he wasn't injured by all for one, which would effectively duplicate that quirk since it's now possessed by Deku. This quirk is even capable of reverting people back to a point before they even existed. It can rewind genetics, which would allow Aerie to turn back human evolution and remove a person's quirk. The quirk only works on living beings, so while it can erase a person from existence, it cannot bring people back into existence or bring the dead back to life. It's a stockpiling quirk that requires the accumulation of an unknown element to work, otherwise the quirk would remain dormant. If you don't know, stockpiling quirks require accumulating something like fat, kinetic energy or strength in order to power the quirk. Fat absorption is a really good example of this as Fat Gum cannot use this quirk unless he eats a lot of food and gets fat. Aria isn't really able to control this quirk due to her young age and inexperience. When she first awakened this quirk, she accidentally erased her father from existence with it. Overhaul was able to take her blood and flesh, which contained properties of this quirk, in order to create a drug that can permanently erase another person's quirk. He also used her to create an antidote which could restore destroyed quirks but it never got used. There are slight manga spoilers ahead, so if you want to stay spoiler free, skip to the time on the screen. Aerie trained her quirk by using it to restore limbs of bugs and lizards. She managed to learn how to completely control this quirk within three months, and she used it to restore Mirio's permeation quirk. A miscellaneous fact about this quirk, Rewind came about as a mutation that wasn't inherited from either of her parents. It doesn't happen often, but it does happen from time to time. Her existence is partially proof of Quirk Doomsday Theory, which is that quirks would evolve to the point where they become super destructive and uncontrollable. And a truly useless fact, Aerie's favorite fruit are apples. This quirk is obviously very dangerous and it has made Aerie's life a living hell. Despite that, it can be very useful for a variety of situations and it's a quirk that I wouldn't mind having. I've gotten used to isolating myself after the events of 2020, so I think I could do it for a few months in order to learn how to use this quirk. This quirk could be used to bring back the symbol of peace and potentially swiftly eliminate some of the biggest threats in the world, like Shigaraki and All for One. I may even be able to use this quirk to keep myself young forever, thus obtaining eternal youth. This this quirk has so much potential that has yet to be achieved since it's in the hands of an inexperienced little girl. However, I am confident that she will use it to do something amazing in the future. And with that, I think we can officially commit Rewind to the Quirk Registry. If you like this video, consider watching another one. I talk about a variety of different topics on this channel, mostly my hero right now, so I hope to see you there. This has been the Hot Rodster. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.